with the president Nana Adudankwe Kufado set to deliver his last State of the Nation address for his first term in office. We hear the streets of uh, Kenten, a suburb of the Chiman, to inquire from residents here of uh, their assessment uh, for his first term, the highs and the lows, as well as their expectations of his second term in office. What I am excited about Nanadu's first term is the introduction of the free senior high school. Because as parents, the free SHS is very important. Some of us have been heavily affected for lack of education. And so that policy is very important for me. Uh, the President Ekufuado, the first term, Adia, the free SHS is the most important policy under Nana Adudanko Akufado's first tenor. But in terms of infrastructure, he failed the country a lot. Like I say, we see infrastructure is not acquired. In fact, we began to hear more. The Osha, a few crowns about 22 years of election. I am sure that is why Ghanaians voted against him during the 2020 general elections. But that for me is not the right thing. The first thing that he have done, uh, he have made a good idea for Whilst they share with us some one or two things they felt went so positive about the first term of His Excellency Nado Danko Kufado, they however have some lows in relation to his first term. The the fine. Maybe driver. Sometimes As a driver, sometimes passengers complain of high fares. But that is and a result of also high fuel food. prices as well and as cost and of spare on parts. Spare parts in the morning, I am born here. The Gusu say, Yakopo Yaduma. Yeah, if you say, I said, so we are hoping that these things are taken care of. This time, I go so you and I say, Bobon Pie, then the Mabekoya, my near meaning the first four years now. I'll go you or number one woman say. What went wrong within the first four years is that as drivers, insurance has to be affordable for us, but that's not the case. So we will be pleased if that is considered in his next step. Going forward, what are their expectations in the second term of the Nana Adudanko Ekufado led government? The government needs to work towards providing jobs for the people. If that is done, there won't be insecurity in the country. I suggest government construct roads, hospitals, and other infrastructural projects that will help develop the country. That is what I think won't help in his second term. From the streets here in Techiman, in the Bono street, my name is Anna Sabit, reporting for Joy News.